Hi there, this is Dr. Evan Osar with the Institute for Integrative Health and Fitness Education. Welcome to this edition of Facebook Live, week number 13, day number four, where we're concluding our discussion about the shoulder complex and really how we look at the shoulder in our clinic, on our clients and our patients. And this is the same strategy I use with my own shoulders to deal with chronic rotator cuff tears and labral tears to continue to do my work as a chiropractic physician as well as continue to do my exercise of choice, which I love to lift weights. Same strategy we use with Janice to solve. We actually eliminated chronic migraines, 21 years of chronic migraines. No relief from medication, no relief from seeing other specialists, but by changing and addressing the alignment and control of our head and neck and rib cage. And for most of our clients that we see with shoulder issues, it's really about changing the alignment of head and neck over top rib cage, so then the shoulder blades, the scapula, can sit on a solid foundation. Because as soon as your shoulder blade has to compensate, your, your scapula has to compensate for non-optimal alignment of the head and neck and a rib cage, you're going to struggle, your client will struggle with getting your scapula to do what you need them to do. So that's why we spend so much time in all our fundamental movement patterns, I should say our corrective exercise patterns, to teach our clients and create awareness and the ability to maintain a more optimal and efficient alignment of the head and neck and rib cage position. That's why we use our breathing, our principles, alignment, breathing, and control to help our clients really establish more optimal and efficient alignment, head, neck, and thorax before we even teach them how to get the shoulder blades to move in the right manner. Yesterday I showed you one of our go-to patterns. It's really one of the patterns we use with almost all our clients. It's a pattern that really helped me start to change both the alignment and control of my head, neck, and shoulders and thorax, as well as teach proper alignment and control of the scapula moving on top of the thorax. So if you missed that video, watch that video first because the concepts we'll, we share today, I'll, I'll share with you today, will develop directly off that pattern that we did yesterday, the quadruped sit-backs. Because the concept is simple. We're going to do a push-up pattern as a demonstration of these concepts, of how we integrate the concepts from our corrective exercise strategy into the fundamental pushing and pulling patterns. So we'll use the push-up as an example. We always start with our clients, really focusing on alignment of the head and neck, over top of the thorax, over top the pelvis. Remember, we want to get that thoracopelvic cylinder aligned, head and neck stacked over top of the thoracopelvic cylinder to the best of your client's ability. We're not trying to make them perfect, we're not trying to fix them, we're just trying to give them a more optimal and efficient strategy for posture and then ultimately for movement. Because that then sets them up. From here, they're going to hinge forward and place their hands on the bar if they're doing an elevated push-up, which is where we start all our clients. Now from here, now they step back, and now you know they're already set up in an optimal position. Because too often our clients just grab the bar, set up, and now you're trying to adjust their alignment when they're in that position, in their loaded position. You can't do that. Set their alignment first, head and neck, over top of the thoracopelvic cylinder, then place the hands on the bar, maintaining that alignment, then step back, and now you know your client's in the proper alignment. And now it's just a matter of controlling the eccentric phase, and then controlling the concentric face. So as you watch your client, there should be no change in their head and neck and their thoracopelvic cylinder alignment. So that way you know you're teaching them an optimal and efficient strategy and now you're reinforcing their posture through their movement strategy. And now their movement strategy helps reinforce optimal and efficient postural strategy as well. So that's how we really use all our fundamental movement patterns to reinforce the optimal and efficient alignment breathing and control that we ultimately want our clients to have and use throughout their day. And that's really the beauty of the integrative movement system. That three-phase process I've been taking you through this week and last week as well. Discover, you do a thorough assessment to discover your client's current posture and movement habits, especially their non-optimal and inefficient habits that we have all have and developed over the years. Then through the corrective exercise strategy, we're addressing, we're helping our clients create more optimal and efficient posture and movement habits and identify those areas where they need a little bit of help, either release work, activation work, and we educate them on creating more awareness around this alignment and how to control it. And then finally, we take those concepts from the integrative movement system, corrective exercise strategy, and integrate them into the fundamental movement patterns to reinforce more optimal and efficient alignment, breathing, and control so that your clients can do the things they need to, want to, and love to do. And that's really the beauty of the system. And all our clients go through the system. And like I said, it's the same exact process took myself through to help my shoulders, took Janice through to solve her chronic years of chronic migraines as well. 
So hope you enjoyed this series, these last couple series. We'll definitely be bringing you more information in the coming weeks leading up to the holidays. And like I said, we didn't do a Black Friday sale or Cyber Monday sale or Small Business Saturday sale. We're just doing a one day special offer on our best programs, the thorax, the shoulder, the hip, knee, the ankle and foot. They're three hour modules. We're also doing a special offer on our live workshop, three day workshop where we take you through the entire integrative movement system, the integrative corrective exercise instructor program. So stay tuned tomorrow, one day only. We're not going to inundate you with tons of emails and offers and sales and last minutes. It's just one day offer. If you're looking for more information and more complete way to look at the shoulder, the thorax, hip, knee, ankle, or foot complex, and or you want to come to a live training with us where we take you through the entire process with myself, Sarah, our trainer and movement specialist here in our office, as well as Janice leading you and a group of like-minded individuals. So this is Dr. Evan Osar with the Institute for Integrative Health and Fitness Education. Make it a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Stay tuned for our one day special offer tomorrow on Facebook Live. Take care. We'll see you soon.